Hello everyone and welcome to Fill the Gap. Today we have Cephalosporin classification. I know it looks so scary but it's not. It's the easiest thing if you learn it with the right tricks. Okay, so first let's go to first generation. You can see it all starts with Cepha. C-E-F-A, C-E-F-A, C-E-F-A. So Cepha is first generation. Now here there is a small exemption except for Cephachlor which comes in the second generation. Now what the examiners do is the questions they frame is like this. All of the following are first generation drugs except and they put one, two, three and this drug Cephachlor all four in the options. So when you look at the options you see okay there's Cepha in all of them. Which one is actually the one in the oh, exemption? So it is actually Cephachlor and it is in the second generation. So Cepha applies to these except this Cephachlor and that is why that is usually asked as an MCQ. Okay, so remember first generation is Cepha. Now let's jump to fourth generation. Fourth generation I want you to remember this Pi, P-I, P-I. So Cephepine and Cephirome is part of fourth generation. So fourth generation is Pi. Next comes fifth generation. Fifth is Rol. I have highlighted it. Ceftarolene and Ceftobiprol. So Rol is coming and that is fifth generation. So first generation Cepha, fourth generation Pi, fifth generation Rol. Done. Now there's second and third generation. And to remember this, we need mnemonics. Why? Because we need mnemonic for this and we need a separate mnemonic for this. Why? Because there are certain um, drugs which are which look similar in both. So we need mnemonics. Okay. So let's start with that. So the mnemonic for second generation is meta. You know, Facebook is Meta now, right? So, Meta has a factory which makes fox fur. So, the fur of fox is made there. And it's taken there and made it into something. And Titan Pro watches. So, Meta has a factory which makes fox fur and Titan Pro watches. Okay, Titan watch, you know, right? So, it's called Titan Pro. So this is a mnemonic for second generation. Now Meta will help you remember Cefmetazole fa has a factory. Factory will help you remember Cefachlor which makes fox fur, fox, Cefoxetine fur, Cefuroxime, Titan, Cefotetan, Pro, Cefprozil, done. So Meta has a factory which makes fox fur and, and Titan Pro watches. So we are done with second generation. Next is third generation. So third generation, these are the names. So generally in third generation, you will see a lot of zyme. You will see dime. You will see zone. Okay. Zyme, zone. Dime, all these things you will see. But there is an exemption. If you remember it like that, there is a problem. If you remember something like Zyme, Dime, uh, anything ending with Zyme, Dime, Zone, the problem is there is another Zyme in this second generation. That's why I put a star here. And they ask that for the MCQ. So this question could, uh, could be like this. All of the following drugs are part of third generation cephalosporins except and they'll put cefixime, cefdiner, cefotaxime and they'll put this one cefuroxime. So when you see zyme you'll automatically think that this is also part of third generation but it's not. Okay this zyme is part of second generation that is why we highlighted the fur here. Okay so Zymes, dynes, zones, mutin. Okay, I have come up with a mnemonic for this. Mnemonic is, there's a person named Zyme. He gave the chef a gold dime, dime at the eating zone while having dinner at Bhutan. Okay, 
so zyme will help you remember all the zymes cephic zyme ceftotaxime cefpodoxime ceftazaxime all right gave the chef a gold dime dime will help you remember this one cefta ceftacidim at the eating zone zone ceftriac zone and there's a cepho para zone this is zone but you can remember it with this zone while having dinner at bhutan so dinner is here there is a diner so cef diner dinner is done at bhutan safety bhutan safety bhutan so third generation is also done so we're done with all the five generation let's do a small recap first generation it's cephas except cephachlor second generation use this mnemonic meta has a factory which makes fox fur and titan pro watches third generation use this mnemonic zyme gave the chef a gold dime at the eating zone while having dinner at bhutan remember when you see zyme don't all these zymes will come under third generation except cefuroxime exception i put a star here okay then for fourth generation pi fifth generation roll now few other mcqs uh, the drugs that are usually asked is cefadroxil cefazolin and from third generation they usually ask the cefdiner and cefbutin so these things you need to remember these drugs you need to remember the ones that i have put stars as well so i hope this was easy for you okay so see you all again do subscribe to my channel thank you